Alright, so this is car number 217-104, 2006 Land Rover LR3. So we'll do our walk around. So this car, uh, the transmission bell housing actually cracked on, so um, which prevents a lot of things from happening. So we can't run and drive this vehicle. Uh, engine uh, has got a lockout on it, so it's not starting at the moment. We're pretty confident everything's in good shape, so once we take things apart, we'll know a little bit better. Black interior. So what we'll do is we'll do our systems check. We just gotta power the vehicle first. So we're gonna pause this. All right, so we should have power um, inside the vehicle here, so we'll kind of show what happens. If we try to start it, um, it'll try and try and try, but it never never gets there. So, um, but again, our dashboard looks like it works. Looks like all the LCDs are in place, um, so we don't see any dead pixels or anything. 130,000 miles in this car. Um, our stereo looks like it works. This does not have nav in this car. So, stereo is working. Steering wheel controls are currently not working. So we'll have to see what we have going on there. Um, and we might have a electronics issue with the body controller in this car because a lot of things are not operating. It's sitting down on its air ride right now. Um, it won't go back up because we can't start it. All the power windows appear to be working. Check our mirrors here in a second. Driver's side window, our mirror works. Motor is not working at all on that right side. Windows up the rest of the way. Power down our AC here because we only have a battery pack on this. So, um, we must have an issue with fuses or a body controller in this car. Um, our lock and unlock are working just fine. Power seat base is working as it's supposed to. Unlocked here. Again, a lot of nice interior panels on this car. Our seat works on the passenger side. Really cracked dash. Clearly the sun didn't do this car any favors. So again, this is a 2006 Land Rover LR3. We'll show the VIN number here in a moment. There's our VIN number. Parts are available on our website, www.playgroundpar.com or our eBay store, Playground Par.